Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the channel. My name is Nick, AKA The Limey. And on this one, we are giving a little facelift to my brand new Pixel Pro 6. So in my unboxing video, if you haven't seen it, there'll be a link to the video in the top corner. I shared with you that I reached out to dbrand and I ordered myself. I reached out, I went on the website, I paid them some money and I ordered some stuff. Um, I reached out to dbrand and I got myself some skins. Now, I love these because they're just protective enough, but they're not big and bulky and they don't change the profile of your phone. So I'm going to install my favorite one, which is the robot camo. I'm gonna install this onto my Pixel Pro 6 and I'll show you guys how I do it. These are a little bit tricky to install, but dbrand are fantastic. They have YouTube videos on how to do all of this. And honestly, I'll probably be referring back to the YouTube videos. So I've ordered the robot camo. So this one will have the robot camo camera bar. It has the robot camo topper and it has the robot camo back. So the whole back of the phone will get completely covered in the robot camo. I did order a couple of extras uh, because I have had the robot camo in the past on my S20, I think on my S20, my Galaxy S20. I ordered the uh, robot camo, really, really loved it. And then by the time the robot camo had started peeling off, it was time to upgrade the phone and get rid of it. I think somewhere in this disaster that I call my office, I have one of these with a S20 backer skin in it. And I've got no idea where it is. It's probably in fairness of the carbon because that's normally what I would go for. Uh, and I have. So I've picked up the black carbon as well. So again, I've done all the same color. So it'll have the carbon effect on the camera lens, carbon effect on the top, and carbon effect on the full body. You'll notice there's the Google logo that's been completely cut out, so you can see it on the back of the phone. There is actually a G for Google. That's been cut out deliberately. And in the packet, I do have a little white carbon fiber, a little white carbon fiber G. Can't see that, will you focus? Focus, please, focus, focus. Focus. And the other skin that I picked up while I was ordering them, as I was paying for shipping anyway, is a black leather effect. Now, again, same thing on this. It's gonna have the black leather top, the black leather over the camera, and the black leather effect on the body of the camera. There is in there a white leather effect for the G, and that will just fit in that tiny little G spot. Ooh. That will fit in that tiny little mark right there where they've cut out the G for me. They will be able to pop in the white version just to really make it sort of pop. So for those of you that have not heard of D brand before, I mean, where, where have you been? Living under a rock? Uh, these guys are one of my favorite companies for apparel, apparel and accessories for mobile phones and tech. They are really popular because of the skins that they make. These are all 3M, they're pretty durable and they work really, really well. And as I said, they don't change the form factor of your actual handset. They just allow you to make it look prettier and it still gives you the protection if you drop it. These are pretty good and pretty resistant on chips, stings, scratches, stuff like that. And they do give you a bit of extra grip opposed to the wonderful, smooth, shiny glass that you'll have on the back of your phone. I have a video where I installed the dark plates on my PS5. That was a dbrand product. I absolutely love it. I've got the robot camo on the front of my PlayStation 5. I've got the black dark plates. Now, if you do follow dbrand, you'll know that they've recently changed the style of their dark plates. They may or may not have had some conversations with Sony over just basically copying the the shape of the PS5 and making it black? Maybe, I'm not gonna say anything. Uh, so now they do a version, I think it's much more rounded and it follows the contour of the actual console itself. But you can still buy the dark plates. So if you do wanna customize your PS5, there is a video and again, I'll leave a link and a card in there. Um, I love dbrand because of the attitude that you get 
Uh, the customer service is all, if you go on social media, it's all bottered. It's all designed to give you a sarcastic, a blunt, a dull answer. Uh, purchased, we knew you would. Delivered, you're welcome. Install, there's only one correct way, okay? So what I'm gonna do is get to the install bit. I'm gonna flick over to a GoPro so I can try and give you guys, whoa! I'm gonna try and flick over to the GoPro. Hi, hi, I've broken you. I'm gonna flick over to the GoPro so you guys can get an overhead shot of me trying to do an install and hopefully I can do it at somewhat real time for you guys so you can see how easy it is, how effortlessly it does go on. But first I need to go and grab something. And the thing that we need is a hairdryer. That's it, we've got to look our best when we put on these dbrand skins. Now I'm just going to figure out somewhere to plug this in. All right. It works. Okay. And there you have your Pixel Pro 6 with a full robot camo outfit. I love the robot camo. I think it makes the phone really look different, really special. And where I live, I know I am the only person that's gonna have a robot camo Pixel Pro 6. Guys, just a super quick video as ever. If you like the videos, if you like what I'm doing, if you're interested in a bit more updates on tech and things that we use in our everyday lives, drop me a follow, drop me a like, subscribe to the channel, leave me a comment. Let me know if you wanna see more videos like this of installing things like dbrand skins and things like that. The dark plates, obviously, there's a video somewhere, linked in the description more than likely. Anything like that, leave me a comment. Tell me what you guys want to see for future content. I've been a bit haphazard on how I'm uploading at the moment. I'm trying to get back to a more regular schedule. There was a video unboxing the Pixel 6 Pro. There was a video about that. Uh, so hopefully you've watched that and now you've seen it get a little miniature facelift. I like it. I'm gonna go spend the next four or five hours of my life completely making this my own, putting all my apps on it, logging into every account that I own, because that's what's gonna be the next fun part, isn't it? Logging in and backing up everything like WhatsApp and all those fun things that you just need to stick in a code. 
make it active and let the phone do what the phone does best. I'll probably sit right here, play some Destiny 2 on my Dark Plates PS5 with the robot camo. Yeah, baby, we did that too. On that, with this, fixing things, playing on that and having some fun. Take care, I'll catch you on the next one.